troubleshoot this call to fact authentication issues. Let's get started. First up, ensure correct time settings on a device. Authenticator apps like Google Authenticator or Author rely on the accurate time on a device. So launch your settings, navigate to the off and off general, click on date and time, toggle on for the off and off set automatically. Once you check that, you'll be good to go. Next, check for backup codes. When you enable to factor authentication on Discord, you are given backup codes. If you are unable to access your authenticator app or receiving two-factor authentication codes, use one of these backup codes to log in. These codes can be found in the security section when two-factor authentication is first set up. If you have saved them, use one to bypass the authentication app. If you no longer have access to these backup codes and are locked out of your account, proceed to next steps. Resync the Authenticator app Likewise, disable VPN and proxy. Sometimes, VPN and proxies may interfere with this course to factor authentication process, especially if they cause a change in your IP location, making this course think the login attempt is suspicious. So, disable it. Likewise, if you are completely locked out of your Discord account because you have lost access to your two-factor authentication and backup codes, you'll need to contact Discord support. For that, launch your preferred browser, then head towards the website support.discord.com. Once you're on this website, you can contact with the Discord customer team. You can have the conversation and with that your problem will be resolved. In the case you have still access to your Discord account through another device or session, you can disable two-factor authentication and set up again. By following these steps, you should be able to troubleshoot most Discord two-factor authentication issues and recover access to your account. If the guide was helpful, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.